Y a continuación tenemos una historia de vida, un testimonio, hoy que hemos estado hablando de problemáticas, una de ellas adicciones, y tenemos la, la historia, el relato de, de una mujer que vivió en situación de calle y cómo pudo encontrar esperanza y cómo pudo salir adelante. Vamos a mostrarlo para ustedes y agradecemos mucho también a La Fuente, las personas que nos lo proporcionaron. This is where I slept. Right here. My name is Melody Collier. I made quite a few bad decisions early on in life and found myself pregnant and homeless on the streets of downtown Seattle. In my mind, I was 100% certain God hated me and I was trying my best to make him mad. One day while at a soup kitchen, I passed out, woke up two weeks later in the ICU. I pleaded with God to let me keep my baby and I had a spiritual awakening. I had a reassurance that it would be okay. I went online for places for women with children to go and House of Hope popped up and we stayed there for two years. This is the actual house that, that we stayed in. Oh my God. Things did not turn around right away. I had to learn how to be a mom again to my boys there. I remember feeling really sad whenever I would think about my bad choices. I had to make a conscious effort to rely on Jesus Christ and I got down on my knees and prayed and I decided to get baptized and I felt this was going to wash it all away. At the baptism, I felt completely forgiven. I felt like a new woman. Like here, you get to start over again. You get a do-over. <laughs> Jesus Christ has rewarded me with happiness. We have peace now. And my boys are thriving. I never could have imagined feeling this amount of peace in my life. My worst day today is a thousand times better than my best day during my time in the streets. Fíjense qué bonita historia, por eso quisimos compartirlo, porque siempre hay una esperanza y para poder lograr esos cambios hay que abrir el corazón, hay que abrir el corazón, hay que dejarse ayudar y siempre podemos empezar de nuevo. Eso es lo que nos muestra. Y quiero agradecer a las personas que nos proporcionaron este video. Ustedes pueden encontrar más de estos videos o más información en lo que es ids.org, en esta página ids.org, o en el hashtag Prince of Peace, así como Príncipe de Paz, hashtag Prince of Peace. Muchas gracias.